A cavity-free mouth is a happy mouth, and early intervention for dental care for kids is key. Roseman Dental is holding their Give Kids a Smile Day this Friday, and dental students Neha and Juan join me now to tell us more in this sponsored interview. Welcome, you two. Good Thank morning. you for having us. Good morning. I love that Roseman does this for kids and for families right here in our state. You do this particular event, Juan, once a year, and what is the turnout typically? like we're looking at 400 to 600 kids this year you know we're looking at a lot of families coming in and bringing their little ones to the event so it's exciting it's such a big deal yeah. I mean dental care is expensive whether you have insurance whether you don't you're always paying something when kids do have those cavities yeah. it can add up yeah. Neha talk to me about the training at Roseman what has your experience been like um, the training is absolutely amazing. We have a great set of faculty. We even have pediatric specialists that help us. And so the doctors are all licensed dentists in the state of Utah and the treatment for the children is provided by third and fourth year dental students who are graduating um, and becoming licensed dentists pretty soon. It sounds like a wonderful place to receive the training and to help. Yeah. Okay, Juan, so let's talk about Give Kids a Smile. This is free dental screenings, free dental cleanings to those 18 and under. Yeah, you got it. And this year Year, you know, we wanted to thank our sponsor, Marathon Patrol and Corporation Foundation, because not only are we giving the screenings and the dental cleanings, but we're offering a $100 voucher that allows kids to come back. We give them a comprehensive exam. We're going to be able to give them radiographs. We're going to be able to give them sealants and then $100 towards treatment of whatever they need to get done. That is a big deal. $100 again for the x-rays, the sealants. Yeah. Okay, I just had a flashback of my own childhood, the sealants. They put that on the teeth to yeah. prevent cavities. Absolutely. It's a must do. Absolutely. Okay, every $1 spent on prevention for oral health issues saves taxpayers $50 in the yeah. emergency care, the restorative care. Yeah. Okay, Neha, let's talk about what else will be happening because you make it fun. You make the day a fun event for kids and their families. Yeah, absolutely. So first impressions are important to us. For many of the patients that come in, it's their very first time being in the dentist's office. So we try to make it as easy as possible for them. We want it to be a good experience. So we have tooth fairies and we have a carnival and just activities that um, help kids with oral hygiene. So it really is meant to be a fun experience and we want kids to know that um, coming to the dentist is not scary and we want them to have a good time. Yeah. 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 So you see little kids who again they're not used to this yeah. and I'm sure that kids are more inclined to listen to you to the experts than right. parents a lot of the time so you can tell them what they should be doing how they should be taking care of their teeth. Absolutely. What is the age that you say kids should start brushing? How young? I think that a lot of brushing is building the habit and so as soon as kids have teeth getting them used to having that brush in their mouth, you know, even if it's a baby brush, um, really starts reinforcing the importance of making sure that the oral health care is taken care of. Yeah. And so as soon as they have those teeth, start doing it. Get them used to it. Absolutely. I have a one and a half year old and I'm trying yeah. that right now and pretty much he puts it in his mouth and just kind of eats the toothpaste yeah. off. Yeah. But you know, we're trying, we're trying our hardest. Yeah. Okay, so this is walk-in only. Yeah. Correct. You don't need an appointment? Not yeah. at all. Mm -mm. You yeah. can just come right in. Is yeah. there some waiting maybe? But if there is, you can go and, and take advantage of the fun things. So with the event, yeah. Um, you know, it's, it's walk-in. We're going to have several students. You know, we're going to be able to host a lot of people at the same time. But uh, like Neha was saying, any, any kids who come in and are waiting, we have the waiting room where they can draw, they can color, they can do activities with a lot of our other dental students. And so it's really an experience, not just for the dental, but for the whole event. So it'll be really cool for them to come. Well, you have made going to the dentist sound so fun that even I want to go. Okay, <laughs> Friday, 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. right there at Riverfront Parkway in Sandy. Go and get that cleaning, get your voucher. You are in good hands. Thank you both so much for being here. It sounds Thank like you. a wonderful event. Thank you Thank for, you for doing that. Yeah, All right.